Get you to top developing stories in the state. Here's the news headlines. Chief Minister Ain Birin assures of passing ordinance to replace plastic bags soon. World Environment Day widely observed in state. News in details. Chief Minister Ain Biren has said that the government will soon pass an ordinance that will ask all concerned to replace the plastic bags with an alternative material. He was attending the launching of Cherry Blossom Avenue at Luang Sangbam today. The Chief Minister said financial help will be extended to those clubs and organizations which want to voluntarily serve for the solid waste management to protect environment. The steps the government has been taken up so far were all taken up with the help of the people. No work can be taken up successfully without people's help. Steps to stop people from using plastic bags will be taken up at various districts. The government will give durations of three months in which the shopkeepers and the public will be asked to replace plastic bags with some other material. On the other hand, efforts will be made to plant cherry blossomed at Kangla and the surrounding areas of Imphal City. Yes. Solid Sagi and a lapa club singdo, Manipur Labour Club Singdo. Properly, my like I do the Gifataba to Renal and the Loy, like I do the Gifataba, Soroka and the Loy, like I do the Gifataba Lampata, Bazada, Tahaloyana, Balad directly talk with a quantum club singdo, talks to talk with all. I look at Maduki the Mata, Solid West Management Gi, Sananaba, Gomena Moida, free the funding to Roga, Angamba, minimum rate under the Sange, Sansi, Sasi, Tabak Hoxi, I was there. Nasi the gateway, state secure in a commitment, Malumina. How only Manunda, Dukan, Sinayani, Plastic, Sinaviganu, Madu, alternative to view, Haydena, a quick appeal to a totally plastic state secure thing, and we Kongzen Nama, a question of any Haydena Sigi, Simayanda, it comes again. The Chief Minister further said Manipur seems to have become a state filled with issues pertaining to communal hatred and other hardships relating to it. It is high time to bring about a positive change in the state. The government has been taken up works that are pro-people. He appealed to the DPC completed candidates of 2013 constable batch to leave the ongoing ban immediately. He said there is no reason the government won't understand the difficulties of the candidates. It's just that the government is bound with some legal proceeding, the chief minister pointed out. In 2013, he said, I strike the river, I have to go to 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 the river, I the launching of Cherry Blossom Avenue was organized by the Institute of Bioresources and Sustainable Development, IMFAL. Agriculture Minister V. Hankalian, PhD Minister L. Diko, Chief Secretary Dr. J. Suresh Babu, Environmentalist M. Ashni Kumar, IBSC Director Professor Dean Bandu Sahu, IMFAL is Adaksha P. B. Mola, Advisor to the Chief Minister Rajat Sethi and many other eminent persons attended the launching program. The men guests led by the Chief Minister planted cherry blossoms sapling around Luang Sangbam Cricket Stadium as part of the launching program. In connection with the World Environment Day, IPR Minister T.H. Biswajit today planted saplings along with others on the campus of the IPR office at Nite Park Chute. Principal Secretary of IPR Athem Muiva, Director Haisnam Bal Krishna and staff of the IPR took part in the sapling plantation program. Minister T.H. Biswajit said it is everyone's duty to protect the environment. He appealed to the people to make joint efforts in the mission to protect environment. It is time the people repla replace carry bags made of other materials such as pepper instead of plastics. Life, compromise 
Hijeri at the Lulan, the Dukandar, Singatraga, Tongan Tuanba, Akogi, manufacturer things that Akogi plastic, see Yamna, Sina Dana, Akogi, Tongan Tuanba, Sigi, Uba, compostable, Uba posting the Sina Regadi, Akogi, a Sigi plastic, Kogi, Ladyba, Indiana Horse, Ujeriba, Amadi, Indiagi, Ladyba, Kui Dreams, Sonamaki fulfilled Tawani, Kui Manipurgi, Ladyba, Prasasinki, Wenesu, Akogi, Nungaiba, Kui of Haba, Huxil, give away among the Propong, when you have a seat at the Pataja in the Punduks again. World Environment Day was also observed at the community hall of Ipatho Kok Lamfelpat. President of Ipatho Kok, Kuntausam Gambir Singh, attended observance. MP Dr. T. Mania said, Water level of Loktak Lake has been decreasing day by day due to the climatic changes. The untimely rainfall occurrence is mainly because of the environment changes. Deputy Chief Minister Y. Joy Kumar said, Air pollution has created a great impact to human beings. Even though people are aware of the global warming, no efforts have been made to prevent from such. Besides, throwing of solid waste at the surrounding of river banks still continues. <laughs> Central Forest Division, Sardar Hills region, in connection with World Environment Day, distributed around 2,000 different varieties of tree saplings and carry bags to the people of Kwaramban Bazar free of course. Range for Range Forest Officer Ilangbom Homan said the World Environment Day was observed on the theme Beating Plastic Pollution. He appealed to the people to use carry bags which can be easily dissolved in soil. He also appealed to the people to plant the tree sapling distributed today in order to save the environment. <laughs> Eco Club of TM College of Science observed World Environment Day on the team Beat Plastic Pollution at the college campus today. Cleanliness campaign was held participated by many teachers and students at the surrounding of the college as part of the observance. Teachers emphasize on judicious usage of plastic with a pledge to minimize it at individual level. Social Student Union of Manipur under the sponsorship of Directorate of Environment observed World Environment Day the at the hold of Maite Council Mori. SP of Tengnopal, Dr. S. Ibomcha, along with members of Socialist Students Union of Manipur, attended the observance. Three saplings were planted at the surrounding of Eston Shined School. Now let's take a short break. SN Girls Academy Class 11 Science Tamnanabagi Emission from Tajare. School Sina qualified Oyabam Nima Pungfana Train to Roboza Sina Tapi Tambiri. Mapungfana Sam Sarba Classroom Amade Kusukulai Fulam Suna Tamlava Laboratory Say. Sang Nine Weekly the Monthly Test Bank Tokli. Subject Kuding Mapangi Expand the Counseling Piri. Nubi Masas in the Mapungfaba Education Yamangal Pibuga Luinana. Fajaba Moral Character Tambiduna. Lamdam Sina Nupi Singh Tawakalanamagi Pandam the Linkaliba. XN Girls Academy Savolban and
Tapi masih lu mikir ini mau tembak manusia nih. Pakai plastik di sini sini tapi arwah ada benda itu orang ada di kanan plastik sini sini. Ada kerja kan dah nak dengan plastik sini 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 ada tu market ada tu tak ada rumah. President of BJP Manipur Pradesh and Rajya Sabha MP K. Babananda has said that the BJP will continue working for the betterment of the people, whether it is the ruling party or not at the center and the state. He said this while attending a boot level meeting organized by BJP Bishnupur Mandal at Ningthaukong today. Member of BJP State Executive Committee K. Krishna Kumar also attended the meeting. MP K. Babananda further said the BJP at the center has launched various schemes that the previous government could not launch. Chief Minister A. B. Ren also launched various schemes in the last one year of the BJP-led coalition in the state. Already, center the paiva, center the rule to the party to the matting in the pull up, pull up, sunny, Adu Madu Baradas and Tapati, Madu Sobati, Aquina Pamzi, Baradas and other party, center the Sakar Paigara, state the Sakar Paira, a quick party ideology to the Hazard, a quick principle to Kamunaga. मसी दी अबे भारत हरी बा जगह ऐसी हो नाच चेंज बगा मसी हो गवर्नेंस तो हम बता अब हम पार्टी ने माना नंबर नहीं है बसी खान का नहीं यार पुतिन यार कहना मरुए ना कहना भारत जैसा तो पार्टी वो कहने पाम in connection with the World Environment Day, the third IRB led by CEO N Herojit planted over 1,000 saplings on the battalion campus at Thobal Kangabok and surrounding areas today. CEO N Herojit appealed to the people to make joint efforts to take care of the planting saplings so that it grows into fully grown trees. A youth group called KMC Riders also planted over 100 saplings in and around Kaithil Manbi military colony today. Volunteers of the group visited all the schools located in the area and planted the saplings with an objective of cleaner and greener environment. The KMC Riders is going to plant about 1,000 saplings in its next venture. A meeting of drafting committee which was formed by the government of Manipur to save the indigenous people of Manipur was held at 10.30 this morning at the cabinet hall of Chief Minister's Secretary, chaired by Chief Minister N. B. Rain. Convener of the drafting committee, works Minister T. H. Biswijit, committee member, health minister, L. J. N. Takumar, minister of agriculture, B. Hangkalian, minister of PHED, L. Diko, M. L. A. Awangbo Niumai, Kasim Vasum, T. T. Haukib, former chief minister, Radha Binod Kweizam, advocate general, Kumarjit, law secretary and additional secretary, home, attended the meeting. However, Committee member, ex deputy chief minister Emily Gai Kangam, president of MPCC T N Haukip, and Emily Muhammad Nasir were not present at the meeting. The meeting discussed about the previous bills and suggestions from stakeholders and people. A drafting committee meeting chaired by chief minister will be held on June 8. It may be recalled that the chief minister Ain Birin had announced through media that efforts will be made to pass a bill in the monsoon session to save the indigenous people of Manipur.
problem began when a few women from Swipper's land had an altercation with some employees of the Shillong Public Transport Service and it snowballed into a violent confrontation between the two groups. Now, the state government has set up the HCL to find a permanent solution to the long pending issues of relocations of the residents of Thiem Il Maulong, Harijan Colony. Deputy Chief Minister Preston Tin Song will head the committee, which will include Home Minister, Urban Affairs Minister, Health and Family Welfare Minister, Agriculture Minister, and Chief Executive Member of Kasi Hills Autonomous District Council. Chief Minister Konrad K. Sangma told the media that the Urban Affairs Department has been asked to submit a report regarding various aspects of Sweeper's colony, such as its history, legal issues, unauthorized occupants, etc. He said the department has been asked to furnish the information at the earliest so that the government can take the matter forward. Now let's head to national news. An Indian Air Force Jaguar air aircraft crashed on Tuesday around 10.30 a.m. in Gujarat's Guj region, according to the reports. The IAF Jaguar was on a routine training mission from Jamnagar. The pilot, according to a news agency, lost his life in the crash. A court of inquiry has been ordered to investigate the cause of the accident. The incident comes a month after IAF helicopter crashed in Assam's Mazuli Island, killing two pilots. Two Indian Air Force pilots were killed in a crash in Mazuli in February, minutes after their microlight aircraft took off on a routine sortie, Defense Ministry officials had said. The aircraft crashed in the Riva Island soon after taking off from the Jorhat Air Base. Once again, let's hear the top stories. Chief Minister Ain Birin assures of passing ordinance to replace plastic bags soon. World Environment Day, Environment Day widely observed in state. That's all we got with ISTV News Bulletin. I'll be back with more updates at 7 p.m.